we're leaning into guided selling and the value of guided selling, right? You're now getting into what you're calling guided coaching. So talk about guided coaching, what you think that the value of that is, and then the marketplace of that and why you think this is so important. Let's take a look at just training. The average sales organization spends about $1,500 per rep in training. And that is 20% higher than any other job function in the enterprise. So we're spending a lot to train our teams. But given all of that dollar spent, when you look at kind of an effectiveness rating, how have sellers been able to achieve quota? Maybe we look at that success metric. They have stayed in this band of about 50 to 60% of sales teams achieving their quota for years. So despite a lot of money in training, the effectiveness rate has not, we haven't moved the needle. And that really causes this challenge we see of what is, what's the difference between training in the abstract and truly coaching, Neil, to your point, this guided digital coaching. And you know maybe an analogy to help frame this for the audience. If we were on an airplane, when we go back to flying, uh, and you think about being on the tarmac and having the attendant come to the middle of the aisle and give the obligatory security briefing. Now this is arguably something that is in all of our interest to know the security, the exits for this airplane and such. If you were to look at that process and look around in the cabin as that attendant's giving the security briefing, you might get, and I've done this uh, just to, as kind of an observation, maybe 10% of the people are actually paying attention to that attendant. They're checking their phone, they're talking to some other people, they're working on some item. And that's what we consider to be training in the abstract, because you're on the tarmac, you don't really sense the, the need for this. Now let's, let's flip the script a little bit. Say we did that security briefing at 30,000 feet with heavy chop and lightning, right? You'd have 90% or 100% of the people looking around for where's the exits. And, and, and that's what we kind of consider to be coaching in the moment. When it's relevant, chop some type of problem, think about that in the sales world of, hey, I need to get in front of this executive. Then that's when you want the coaching. You don't want the coaching in some abstract training classroom. You want it to be done when you need it uh, in terms of your, doing your job. And so that's this concept of guided digital coaching that we're passionate about. And we feel like it's helping provide the coaching in the moment while somebody's doing their job. And so things like, hey, I don't know how to calculate value, or I don't know how to get in front of this executive, or what's the right way to position an outcome. Doing that right in the workflow of them selling is gonna have a higher return rate than doing it in the abstract. And so we're really passionate that we can disrupt this training paradigm by providing just-in-time coaching.